Hi everybody, welcome to Cisco Live EMEA here in Amsterdam. What a week, what an exciting week of engagements with customers, with partners, with our sellers. Lots of great conversations around collaboration, around WebEx by Cisco, and really an awesome week. One of those partners that we work really close with from a WebEx perspective is our good friends here in Collective. And Garrett here is from Collective. Yes. So Garrett, tell me a little bit about Collective. Well, first thing, Colm, I just want to say thank you uh, for being so gracious and keen to do these interviews uh, in Las Vegas and Amsterdam and, and doing morning interviews and keeping us coherent is, uh, is a feat unto itself. So I really appreciate the, the job that you're doing here. Um, so Collective is, has been a Cisco partner now for we're going on about a year and a half since we started the relationship. And really it's, it's all about um, taking what we do and where our uh, specialty is in delivering video across massive enterprise uh, footprints. So you know if you have collaboration uh, going on inside of you know, uh, VPN, uh, offices, at-home users. Uh, no surprise here, I'm talking about the hybrid world that we all live in. Uh, but you want to treat every one of your users uh, with a great experience. Uh, and when it comes to WebEx and you know, webinars, WebEx events, and everything to really distribute uh, a message out to everyone, treat them all just equally out there that they can get that content um, and have a great experience. That's that's where Collective and WebEx are doing something really special today. Okay, very good. And you mentioned that word, uh, there's two words that float around in the internet. Oh, One sure is, is AI and the other uh -huh. is, is hybrid work. Um, what are you seeing as regards hybrid work? Like, you know, we live it on a day-to-day -day, day -day basis. What, what are you seeing on a day-to-day -day basis in collective? So, so this yeah. is one of the most interesting things. We're, now, we're very privileged that, you know, powering collaboration across these um, large enterprises, one of the things that we get to see is we get to kind of see this, you know, aggregate usage pattern on how collaboration is happening, how video is happening uh, across a hybrid environment. And one of the things that our, a lot of our customers have experienced is that sometimes you don't always know how things are going, say, in one part of the world and how that varies and is different from another part of the world. So it's actually collaboration and the WebEx suite itself, a lot of times is one of the key indicators for a company of like, oh, my office in Jakarta is actually people are in. And I can see how many people are in because we get to stream those analytics back in and the observability side of what we're doing for collaboration gives you a, a really keen insight into you know, where people are in the office, where people are at home, and what kind of experience they're having collaborating. Uh, and so we're seeing uh, almost every single one of our customers has just a wild range of scenarios that they have to deliver the collaboration in. So uh, it's ubiquitous. We're getting a little bit more of the in office some days, out of office other days. And so that's where really kind of the, we're seeing some choppiness in sort of the presence in and out of office. And I just think that's kind of the norm. We have to be ready as technologists to satisfy that. So addressing the market needs, so yes. to speak. And I think we yes. all live yeah. that day to day. There's this, yeah. You know, some people at home, some people in the office, and, and everything in between. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, going back to those, uh, that experience, work is an activity, not a location. That's right. Okay. That's okay. Precise. Get it. So, any particular segments of industry where collective fits in from a solution perspective. Once again, bearing in mind people who will be watching here, a mixture of customers, sellers, yeah. developers, et cetera. So, uh, first of all, it's a, it's a fantastic question, because sometimes you, you specialize in a, in a sector uh, or in a specific market, um, but the nice thing about our solution and WebEx is you can throw us in anywhere, and we're going to be able to make sure that collaboration happens effectively, and that you actually have a full observability into the experience with collaboration. So we have customers in actually every single vertical you can imagine, from manufacturing uh, to uh, you know the, the financial uh, sector is is a uh, has a massive need. If you imagine lots of branch offices with you know sometimes 20, 10 people in each of those branch offices, and you've got 80 of them scattered across the globe to um, the insurance uh, okay. and uh, really automotive, uh, we can go on and on, but it's basically every single vertical applies everywhere. So I think everyone very, needs to collaborate. It's horizontal right? more than It's vertical. a horizontal, horizontal play here, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay. Yeah. okay, and where do you see 
the technology going from an AI perspective? Are yeah, you seeing yeah. that from your market perspective? So we absolutely are, and, and like I think that I, as a product leader, I get docked pay if I don't say AI in each conversation that I have anywhere that I have it. Uh, so I'm glad that we brought this up. This means that I'll, I'll, uh, I'll be good for the month here. Uh, but we absolutely see the need for AI. And what we're doing with AI and machine learning uh, is actually, you know, we're, we're kind of funny, a little bit tongue in cheek about it, but we call it blue collar AI. Uh, because what we're doing, especially for the collaboration suite, is we're doing a ton of uh, AI work in anomaly detection. So mm. if you have a part of your network where collaboration usually goes really well, but what we want to be able to do is say, if things are starting to, you know, say take a turn for the worse, you build up some latency or people are having buffering experiences mm. and it just doesn't seem like they're getting the video, well, we need to flag that in real time, feed that back to the observability suites and make sure that the infrastructure people or the app delivery people can actually fix that in real time. So, uh, you know, the, the common refrain that we've heard a lot this week actually from, uh, from Cisco has been, you know, say goodbye to the war room. And that's really where the AI is, you know, it's, it's not a grandiose vision. It's actually like, we're getting just making ahead work better day to day, yeah. right? Yeah, mm -hmm. getting ahead of the problem and making sure that we have the tools and the alerting systems where we can recognize patterns that are out of whack on the fly and just kind of cutting out all the troubleshooting and sometimes just time wasted. Uh, so, so blue collar AI, AI is, uh, you know, we like to sit down there and just say, you know, this is for the, the, the doers, the technologists. We want to give them uh, AI tools uh, that make their lives easier more and better. More efficient, more productive, exactly. more transformed. Exactly. It's always in that area, it yeah. Always is. And from a technology perspective, well, where are you guys going next? Where do you envision yourselves yeah, going next? Uh, brilliant question. Uh, because I love talking about that. You give a, <laughs> give a product guy, you know, we, we light a match and say we reinvented fire. Um, yeah. <laughs> so uh, where we're headed is actually deep into the, the world of observability. And really, we, we call it kind of connecting the dots. So the observability um, side of collaboration is really, really interesting because where, you know, you say the VP of comms, you know, wants to be able to have town halls where everyone gets the same corporate message or there can be you know, alignment between business units. Uh, collaboration is so key to us working together inside of an organization. Uh, but really, you have to connect the dots from the collaboration suites into the network mm -hmm. world and into the uh, infrastructure world and into the observability world at the mm -hmm. end of the day. So this entire uh, Cisco Live EMEA has really been about connecting the dots and really where Collective is driving both from just a capability standpoint on delivering really, really effectively across the globe to make sure that collaboration happens well, but then making sure that the, the network teams and the infrastructure teams have the tooling that connects collaboration with the tool underneath it uh, that delivers that okay. collaboration. So really, a lot of our innovation is going to be on, on that side of the world and just getting joining really- Joining up the dots, as you say. Joining, yeah. connecting those dots, okay. and uh, just making sure that no matter where someone is in the world at any given moment, that they can collaborate with their coworkers. Okay. In conclusion, in some respects, you know, we've lots of customers out there listening to us, lots of resellers, partners, the people that we want to engage with on a day-to-day -day basis. Where can I find out more? What's the yeah. easiest way? So the, the easiest way, collective.com obviously is, uh, is a great, great starting point. But uh, booth D17 uh, is another great way to swing by. We love having conversations. Or any conversations. other trade show where Cisco is. Any yeah. other trade show where Cisco is. I think we got some special stuff lined up for uh, Cisco Live in Las Vegas. And so Excellent. we're going to be really excited to be there with you again. And, uh, and call I always love being uh, with you and talking with you. So. Uh, so yeah, so we're, we're looking forward to uh, uh, connecting with any partners, uh, customers, and my sales team would want to say prospects as well. Uh, naturally. Looking, naturally. Naturally looking yeah. at a, a collaboration, what Collective and Cisco can do for you. Excellent. Look, thanks very much, Gareth. Well, thank you. Um, folks out there, awesome interview. Thank you very much. Um, great show here at Cisco Live in EMEA, and talk to you again real soon. Cheers, bye.